This YCN segment is brought to you by Harris Family Furniture in Plymouth, Laconia, and Chichester. The offenses from Plymouth Regional in Alvern High School scored more than 700 points combined over 22 games in 2018. While the teams had similar seasons in many ways, the biggest difference between the squads was experience. The Bobcats were two-time defending state champions and hadn't lost a game since 2016, while the Broncos were making their first state final appearance in program history. If Alvern wanted to complete an amazing year with a championship, they'd have to start the game off strong. And that's exactly what they did. The Broncos began the matchup kicking off to their opponents. Plymouth senior Owen Brickley caught the ball and attempted to give his team decent starting field position. But Alvern's junior Travis Perry forced a fumble and his freshman teammate Andrew Porter recovered. The Broncos shockingly took over on Plymouth's 30 yard line. At first, the Bobcats' defense held firm and forced a quick fourth down in six situation. But Alvern sophomore quarterback Kyle Gora made a perfect over-the-shoulder pass to his senior teammate Jack Regan. Jack made the catch for a big 12-yard touchdown. A two-point attempt just came up short, so Alvern, not even three minutes in, led 6-0. Plymouth began their first possession with multiple first down runs from Brickley, who was eager to make up for his costly fumble that opened the game. Eventually, Brickley helped move his team all the way to the nine yard line. Owen then on third down ran right up the gut for a rushing touchdown after two fake handoffs. Senior Patrick Mom put in a successful two point conversion, so Plymouth now led eight to six. On Alvern's first play from scrimmage during their next drive, senior James Bertrand rattled off a huge 47-yard run that helped set up a one-yard rushing touchdown from Broncos QB Gora. Again, a two-point attempt failed, so Alvern regained the lead 12-8 with the first quarter coming to a close. The Bobcats' next drive ate up around nine minutes of the play clock as Brickley and Mom stuck to the ground. Long runs from both seniors helped move the chains all the way to the six-yard line. Patrick Mom was soon given the handoff and he ran up the middle for the touchdown. Peter Wingstead kicked a successful extra point, which gave the Bobcats a three-point lead, 15-12, with five minutes left before the break. During Alvern's next drive on their first play, Bertrand broke off another huge run, this time for 67 yards to set his team up in the red zone. But the Broncos soon faced a fourth and goal situation on the six yard line. They then used a double handoff trick play, which set up a touchdown pass from running back Jack Regan to quarterback Kyle Gora. A third straight two point attempt failed, so Alvern went into the locker room up 18 to 15. It was the first time all season Plymouth didn't have the lead at halftime. If the Bobcats wanted to win their third straight state title, they'd have to start off the third quarter with intensity. 